everybody. So I know none of you guys have seen this yet, but I decided to get a new tent. So I have the Fast Gear the two, and I just practiced pitching it again. My backyard is not big enough. So this is actually only the second pitch I've ever done on this tent. Hence why I lost a stake and the tent <laughs> fell over when I was trying to set it up. Um, but this is going to be my new home away from home for the next six months on the Appalachian Trail. Um, I've been very pleased with it so far. I have not tried it out in storms yet. I'm a little apprehensive about the wind and a whole bunch of rain just because I don't trust my pitch nearly as much as I should. Um, but I feel like I did a pretty good job and this tent is actually like really large on the inside. Um, and I love that it has the double vestibules. Um, and lots and lots of space for everything. So we'll see how this goes. It's definitely a bigger tent than what I'm used to, um, but I've been pretty pleased with it so far. I just need to really spend some time outside in it, but I figure six months is probably a decent amount of time to spend out in it. So we'll see how this goes. <laughs> I just pitched my Gossamer Gear, the two tent, and I did successfully get my guy lens out. I don't know if that's the correct configuration for them. So if you guys want to comment below and let me know if I have that pitched appropriately, I would greatly appreciate it. I also wanted to show you a modification that I made to the tent. So normally if you wanted to stake out your bathtub, you would have to purchase and buy or um, bring extra stakes for the corners. I didn't really want to do that because it's a lot of extra weight. So what I did instead was I just took this uh, length of line that I had spare line that I had laying around and I went ahead and just tied like a double fisherman's knot in it um, so that I could actually pull it to whatever length I needed. Um, I don't know if I can show you and do it at the same time. Yeah. So that just pulls it tight and that helps me stake out my bathtub without needing extra stakes. So I went ahead and put the clothesline up in, on the inside, um, which is one of the modifications that you can make to the in interior of the tent. I'm right at least trying to get inside. So you can see it just right up there. Um, and that's an easy way to um, pitch my clothes or I can actually hang my light up there as well. And just really quick while we're in the inside of the tent, this thing is super, super spacious. I'm a very small person. I went ahead and got the two um, just to have a little extra space. This is actually a lot more space than what I'm used to in a tent. And I love that it has two vestibules and very large ones at that.